For 50 years, this marshland 100 kilometres from Medang, on the north coast of Papua New Guinea, has preserved its secret. A secret discovered only three months ago, when all that could be seen was the aircraft's tail. Apparently, the pilot of the World War II Boston bomber made an emergency landing on what he thought was grass. The crew escaped, but the aircraft vanished into the three-metre mire of mud. It was too good an opportunity to miss for the RAF team, already painstakingly rebuilding two similar aircraft at Amberley in Queensland. With some finance from the Australia Remembers Fund, a combined Defence Force team of recovery experts swung into action. The assistance of local villagers invaluable. This is the sort of country that, uh, that they can cope with and we can barely manage. Finally, the Boston was ready and the star of the show was called in. A giant Russian mill helicopter, the world's biggest, delicately pulled the bomber from its watery grave of the last 50 years and it was on its way to Medang. In near perfect condition after being preserved from ultraviolet rays and souvenir hunters, the aircraft will now be cannibalised for use in the two Bostons already partly restored. When completed, one will take pride of place at the RAF's Aircraft Museum, the other a gift to the people of Papua New Guinea. Leif Manifold, 10 News.